I can't see everybody in Georgia because I think that's probably the biggest poll local monthly for most people in Georgia. Absolutely. I think that we're getting into the match now. Uh, I wish Cookie would bring up the uh, stream chat <laughs> instead of just doing whatever. Oh, well, so yeah, they're getting right into it. Ben's playing pretty aggressively. Interesting here. He's not going for the lasers, even though they're on FD here. Yeah, it's like he's got plenty of space to work with, but he's already got stage control. So yeah, I no, I mean, definitely go with it once you got it. Can't really argue with what works. Yep. Um, but then again, I, when you're playing at the ledge, the angle. you know, it takes two seconds to switch switch sides or uh, switch sides of the coin. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I think the Falco wins this matchup by kind of running away a lot using lasers because here, here Martha's kind of advantage on FD. You know, he's got the chain grab going on and. Definitely has a lot of things that he can bring out here. Mm. Well, because he's got, I mean, I haven't seen Marth dash dance once yet, but mm. I think that's because he wants to actually stay on Ben. But Ben's not really saying no to that. Usually when you see a player is like, I want to do this, you say, okay, I'm going to take that and not let you do that. Yeah. But I, I can't really say yay or nay on what's working or not because... Quite frankly, it's just kind of taking trades here and there in the neutral game. Like, Falco's kind of starting to get Shine into Dare going and yeah. getting him off stage. But other than that, it kind of ends up at the, at the ledge again. And like that first stock where John or Josh Tush, or Josh Tush, Josh took. Josh took. Um, English is a great language. But Josh took Ben's stock. And that was just, hey, he missed, he missed like a ledge. Uh, ledge guard and then he was off the ledge and then he was gone it was yeah like, okay and i think that's where this is going to be won at least for them the neutral game will help Ooh. get some percentage especially with like a couple tippers like that yeah but it's going to be decided at the ledge for sure for them that was really interesting the, the forward smash you got before the one that killed <laughs> it was off bad di on a dash attack that's a really neat little combo there i i can only wonder if he just predicted that he was going to di poorly or if he reacted to that di because that would have been a really tight reaction Ooh, ooh, perfect grab opportunity. This go. should be the edge guard. And there nope, we go. He doesn't go off stage. Oh, wow. This Falco's uh, angles are a little yeah. fraudulent here. Because they're a little too high. And he's, I yeah. mean, he's, he's, not, um, he's, he's only using the grooves of the controller rather than going for the, the complicated and tricky angles. I mean, there's like over 100 angles you could do with Fox or Fox and Falco's upbeat. Well, no, there's 360 angles. <laughs> well, then there you go. <laughs> but, but yeah. Is there one for every degree? I don't think there is. I, I don't know how the wave bird no, works I, I, in there. I think there's fewer than 360, but it, it's whatever. I love going into the wave bird, but <laughs> yeah, I, I, if I, uh, Ooh. I'm going to break it eventually if I go into my controller too often. But it looks like it looks like Ben's starting to kind of calm down a little bit. He's at last stock and he's at a higher percentage than Josh's, so he now he's wanted. Scared to, for a minute. He wants to play with a little more space. Mm. It looks like, but now that he's kind of. Yeah, he was yeah. trying to find himself for too long there. He played really scared at the beginning of that stock. Yeah. yeah, I think he found up like or wound up finding something that worked, but just couldn't really fully roll with it. And even then, like I think they're getting comfortable playing each other. Yeah. But Ben didn't have necessarily enough time to mm -hmm. kind of bring that to maturity. Yeah, yeah uh, someone in chat confirmed what I believe. This is game two. Yeah. Uh, uh, Josh. Josh won Josh. first game. Yeah, um, there, there are 360 degrees on the, the control stick, which yeah, is not 360 different angles. For, for what actually the Waybird acknowledges as a d as an, an angle. An angle, yeah. They don't have 360 angles programmed in. But. I should have done that because those things, I mean, the controllers are really interesting to go inside of. But yeah, also, I've got my try one with me, actually. <laughs> Just in case. You never know. <laughs> you never know. Ooh. But I, I like, like this. Yeah, I like Ben's uh, play style a lot more here than on FD. I think if you're going to go in and be really aggressive, it definitely works in the, the area where lasering is more difficult, you know? Yeah, and he's using lasers to approach, Ooh. which is good. He's It seems to be working oh. out a little better for he him, but he also Josh. saved him. He saved him, but hey, you got to give a homie stock for that. <laughs> but he's playing... I saw him kind of favor the platforms a little bit. I think he likes having the platforms above him as compared to FD. I don't think he really wanted to be there. So unfortunately, guys, uh, Cookie took the chat away from us again, so it looks like we're not really going to be able to interact with y'all for now. Uh, hopefully he comes back pretty soon and we'll be able to see once again. So if you've got any shit to talk about us, now would be the time to do it. Yeah, we can't see it. Go ahead and talk about us. But it looks Man, like yeah. Ben's really kind of finding a rhythm. Mm -hmm. As I said, I mean, I think the stage is really favoring him here. It's Although, like his play style is really working on this stage. Although not, not with a... 
where credit's due, Josh really kind of making the ledges work for him. The middle of the stage is not his friend right now, but he's making the ledges work for him a little bit. I mean, yeah, like, this is what he's going to have to do to recover two stocks uh, deficit against Falco. And that'll do it. Ooh. Stuff like uh, that. Let's just see more of that. Yeah, it's really, really hard to cover the uh, spacey spot dodge. And especially plus, it's like you spot dodge the grab and tell me how you're going to avoid a shine. It's it's just not going to yeah, work. No, I mean, it's difficult for sure. And this should be the dodge guard. Yep, that's the game. Clean three right. stock. But now it's 1-1. One, one. It is indeed 1-1. One, one. I think that was really it. Like, you can see how scared he was playing in the first game. Mm -hmm. But now that Dog's kind of got his feet under him, or we call him Ben or Dog? <laughs> Let's call him. Uh, I mean, he's using the Ben tag. Let's call him Ben. Okay, so Ben's now that he's got his feet under him, I think he's going to do really well in this game three just because he's like, okay, I've got platforms. I know what Marth does. Yes, this stage does. I mean, I'm, I'm just confused as to why he struck to final. Yeah, no, seriously, because he. You could have easily got it to either, like, final destination or... Because, I mean, FD is the only one without the three-platform setup. Yeah, I mean, maybe uh, maybe his plan was that he was going to try his best FD but didn't want to give his opponent momentum for if he takes him to FD game two. Maybe it was just sandbagging. I don't, I don't think so. He's trying it out. He's like, all right, I'll, yeah. see, I'll see how good he is by giving him my worst stage. But it seemed like he didn't know what to do there because he wasn't using, like, the laser, you know, runaway stuff. He was, yeah. he was just, like, playing, like, his... Like he's playing here with platforms, or even approaching with lasers. Like he's, no, he's he was using like, approaching lasers a little bit, but he's using it so much more and I, honestly a lot more effectively. Because even if like I'm, oh, I just think that it's more effective on this stage. Not necessarily that he's using it any differently. He's he appears to be using it in the, the same way he used it on FD. It's just having this uh, this low space like three platform kind of stage yeah. setup really benefits his style like, here. He has vertical he has vertical options yeah, as opposed moment. to just straightforward. Cookie, Brandon. Cookie. We're trying to get the chat back. Can you bring chat back up. Oh, and he just murdered that poor little shy guy. He shot him in the face. Ben's ruthless. He just murdered a shy guy. He literally took time just to shoot one shy guy. <laughs> That's fantastic. Okay. All right. All right, chat. We got you back, guys. Till Cookie do us part. <laughs> And I actually haven't seen him. I haven't seen Ben use Bear a ton. Yeah. I've seen it, but I feel like he favors, well, I guess Shine into Dare a I, lot more. Often. I think it's good not to rely on that. Definitely. Uh, the the absolutely. Bear is for sure like a really great tool for Falco in this matchup, but if you rely on it, like uh, Marth could for sure outspace you with Forward Air. Oh, yeah. So but I think he's using a, a good amount of Bear. I mean, hard to say. I think now that he's got the platforms, it's time to break it out a little bit. Yeah. Interesting. He's playing scared again. See, like yeah, he just kind of like rolling around, like a shield. I guess it's because he's at high percent, but it's not good to do that every single stock. Because yeah, he's got I mean? an extra stock to work with. Yeah. You see, he's holding the lead. But it's oh. I yeah, it's working out for him now. Josh is not grabbing, and it's but hard to is, grab. I mean, this is mostly just neutral game stuff. But he's doing a really good job at just. Ooh. I mean, it's whatever. I was gonna say tacking on damage, but. Uh, <laughs> No, not exactly tagging on any damage with that uh, side B, but hey, I mean, what, SDing at 150, you could do a if lot worse. If it makes worse. him more comfortable playing his stocks, then I think it's worth it because he was making a lot less progress staying at high percent, playing scared, mm -hmm. and if that was what's hindering him, then more power to him. Get in there. Yeah, absolutely. That was an amazing edge guard by Josh. I have to say that. Like, Didn't want to interrupt you there, but it was, oh, no, it was totally. very sick. I think... Uh, Clean up an early stock. Oh, oh, what's going to happen? He's playing hide Ooh. and seek. If he... Oh, man. Yep. Careless SD ends the stock, yep. or ends the set, rather. Uh, yeah, you could tell what he was trying to do there. He wanted to angle his shield down and then 